earlier you talked about open source, so that's when I want to talk about uh, the uh, the big announcement, which is uh, introduction of open source project OpenBS Code Server. Tell me what is it? What problem are you trying to solve with it? Yeah, so the OpenBS Code Server is just the one small bit, like that is the web IDE interface that you get by default with Gitpod or also GitHub Code Spaces. Like the VS Code team has done a really great job building a very popular editor and they have changed the architecture so that it also runs in a browser server context. Unfortunately, they haven't released the, um, you know, the secret source you, you need in order to, uh, to run this uh, in that way. And since so many people ask how we do that, we just thought, hey, let's, you know, let, let's build a vanilla thing, make it a blueprint so everyone understands how to run uh, Gitpod in, in uh, not Gitpod, uh, open, the VS Code in such a context. And so, yeah, we released that. And, you know, that said, uh, by default, when you access Gitpod, you get VS Code in the browser, but you can access your workspaces also with the desktop version of VS Code. You can access it through SSH, you know, you can use, use VI or so. And then also we are working with JetBrains on a um, integration with their JetBrains IDE. So with Git, for Gitpod, it's super important that people understand this is just your very professional dev environment, all the tools you need running in the cloud to be automated. And you can access that with your favorite IDE. It's an open source project. Can you talk about whether it's going to remain a company project? What kind of plans do you have to also attract a wider community around it? Uh, who are you targeting with this project? Um, sure. The, like we are targeting with OpenVS Code Server um, individual developers who just want to um, use an IDE in the browser with their whatever machines they have running somewhere, but also adopters like we've been working with um, a bit of with our studio who are uh, you know, have an interest of running it in their um, context but also with likes of uber or shopify who have internally kind of something similar to gitpod or code spaces already and you know building building this and also need an interface for that um, so these are kind of the uh, the groups who are using that but actually long term i think uh, we would love to see Microsoft or the VS Code team um, taking this over, and we are happy to, you know, to um, help them maintaining that. It's not a lot of code, but I think ideally it would belong into the uh, the main VS Code uh, project.